Hey, Doug here with Hope360. Hey, I want to um, provide some resources to those of you who are maybe going through uh, the thick of it. Maybe you're going through a hard time right now and you just feel like you can't take any more of it. One, uh, one devotional that I still read to today, and it, it's just a great devotional, is, um, and, and by the way, none of these replace the Bible. Uh, I, I think these are good to read alongside and, and um, you know, accompany the Bible. But one is called Jesus Calling. And I want to read the devotional um, that I read today on Jesus Calling. And here's what it says. Rejoice in me always. No matter what is going on, you can rejoice in your love relationship with me. This is God talking, obviously. This is the secret of being content in all circumstances. So many people dream of the day when they will finally be happy. When they are out of debt, when their children are out of trouble, when they have more leisure time, and so on. While they daydream, their precious moments are trickling into the ground like precious balm spilling wastefully from overturned bottles. Fantasizing about future happiness will never be will never bring fulfillment because fantasy is unreality. It's almost over here. Even though I am invisible, I am far more real than the world you see around you. My reality is eternal and unchanging. Bring your moments to me and I will fill them with vibrant joy. Now is the time to rejoice in my presence. So the gist of that devotional is just to um, get along with God, seek God, and draw into these devotionals, draw into the Bible, and just try to be present with God, be quiet with God, and hear what he has to say. I want to share a verse with you. It's um, Philippians 4, 4, through 12, 4 and 12. Rejoice in the Lord always. I say it again, rejoice. I know what it is to be in need, and I know what it is to have plenty. I have learned the secret of being content in any and every situation, whether well-fed or hungry, whether living in plenty or in want. And again, that's Philippians 4, and then it's 4, verse 4 and verse 12. So I hope that encourages you if you're um, just going through a hard time. That is a great devotional Jesus Calling that I, like I said, I read daily. And I would encourage you to maybe get a copy if you are going through tough times. Hey, thanks again for watching. I always say like, subscribe, forward this video. If it just helps one other person, it's, it's always obviously well worth it. All right, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.